know we're delighted with the result in fr on Friday over in King's Home. It was a it was a tough game, and you know we we pulled away at the end, but it was definitely a lot tougher than it looked on the scoreboard. And you know we got a a good away went up in the sports ground as well the week before. So you know we're, we're coming into a bit of form now, and it's definitely what we need to go into this weekend. How enjoyable is it as a second to to play in this team at the moment? The way that that you're attacking at the moment and the the partnerships that you're building up it's phenomenal. The last couple of games. Yeah, it, you know our attack. We're working on it every week. You know since the start of the season, and it was a big work on from last year. It's probably where we let ourselves down the later part of the season, and um, you know it's it's definitely getting better the last few weeks. And you know you've guys come back to full fitness, and Joey slotting in nicely. Chris Farrell's back in the mix as well, which is massive for us. So you know I think we're playing some some good rugby at the moment, and it's an important time of the year as well to be doing it. Yeah, and something as well that a good majority of the squad are fit. I mean, coming up to this point of the year, it's not often that you have so many players fit. It's a, it really is a, a case that it can change week to week or coming up to a pivotal point of the season. But in full battle at the moment, the squad and that competition as well in, in training must be fantastic to have. Yeah, it's great. We haven't had this many guys fit uh, for a period now in a long time. and. The injured players group is getting smaller and smaller, which is great. And you know, there, as you said, that's what you need as well. Competitive training sessions. And, you know, there's there's big competition in the squad now, especially in the backs, the back row, the front row. You know, the second row. <laughs> when everyone's fit, there's not really any weakness or weak point in the team. And it's great to have that uh, that competition in the squad. And as you said, it's an important time of the year to have everyone fit. Saturday evening game to look forward to now. A packed out Thomond Park against a side that are looking to top the group the same as yourselves are a real knockout feel to it and I'm sure it's something that every player going out on the pitch is, is going to relish. Yeah definitely you know we always enjoy playing in a, a full house in Thomond Park and you know Exeter are probably in a position now they didn't think they'd be in a few weeks ago and they've got a maximum 10 points in their last two games and as you said it's just a straight shootout now really that's the way we're looking at it that we just have to get a win on, on Saturday to, to progress to the quarters and whatever else happens that's out of our hands but that's all we're concentrating on now and it's just a, a straight head to head. In terms of, of your own career and, and looking at these big European games Joe Schmidt will obviously always have an eye on them how important is it to, to put in top performances in these games with the ambition to, to get into that Six Nations squad? Yeah, it's obviously they're the games they're looking at the Interpros and the and the European games as, as the big ones and I haven't really thought about the, the selection now a whole lot. It's, it's been a, t a big few weeks for us in the club and as you said, you're just concentrating on your own performance and you know if you if you do that do do well over those couple of games and you put your hand up and whatever else happens after that, it's kinda of out of your hands. But yeah, obviously you're just hoping to play well and if you get in the into the Six Nations squad, great. Or you defensively against Gloucester there was a, a massive effort put in and made them more work really, really hard for their scores. How important is that you replicate that defensive uh, game for this week? Uh, yeah, it's going to be very important. You know, I, I know we conceded a try, but I think we held them out for 35 phases. It was probably the best defensive set we've had this year. I know it was disappointing to concede in the end, but I think as a team on the pitch, we got stronger after that, and you know we really pushed on. And I thought our defence was outstanding at the weekend, and um, you know we, we need more of the same against a great attacking side like Exeter this week. Some of the guys that haven't experienced a uh, round six game in Thomond Park, third superior, which is winner take all affair. Uh, what will you be telling those guys, the likes of Mike Haley, who hasn't? Yeah, it's going to be a big occasion for the club, and you know, it's we've probably been been more comfortable the last two seasons going into round six, but you know, it's 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 enjoyable as well. You know, we enjoy playing in a full home in Park, and a lot of those guys experienced it against Leinster as well a couple of weeks ago. So, you know, we'll be building nicely now towards the weekend, and you know. We're <laughs> We don't want to get them too nervous or anything going into the game, but uh, it's an exciting occasion, and it's, I'd say they're looking forward to it. Roy, could you just uh, describe what, um, what, what it's like playing inside Chris Farrell at the moment? Obviously, he's like really influential alongside himself at the weekend, and just like maybe just kind of the differences between playing with other centres. Yeah, just <laughs> his physicality is massive as well, but he's also a very good ball player. His skills are phenomenal, and you know he, when you have a tread like that outside you, you know he, he tends to take the, the defenders away from me which is great but uh, yeah his his communication on the field you know he's always giving you options and you know having Joey inside as well is great and I think we're uh, we're combining nicely together we're coming to an important time of the season and yeah we really enjoy playing on Friday night.